So, in our morning work today, we are starting on lesson number 13 for simple solutions. Number one says to rate the sum. What is the sum of 0 plus 2? Remember, these, the sum is the answer to an addition equation. Add them. 2. If you have 0 things and you add 2, now you have 2 things. Number 2, how many pigs in all? How many? What did you say? Close. Try again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7. Seven pigs. Number three, write an addition sentence to go with these bananas. Jordan. Very good. One plus three equals four. Number four says which word says seven? Which of these words says seven? Now, an easy way to do this is when you say the number seven, v, 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 what sound do you hear in the middle of the word? V, right. So that means you want to find the word that has a V in it. Which word is it, Mr. Christian? The middle word. So seven, S-E-V-E-N. Tommy, put your water on the ground, friend. Thank you. Number five, what day comes right before Saturday? Caitlin. Friday. It's like tomorrow is Friday, and it comes right before Saturday. Number six, how much money is this? Um, Isabel. Five cents. Good. Those are pennies, so you just count one, two, three. Three, four, five. Number seven, what is this shape? A circle or a rectangle? Claire? A rectangle. A circle or a rectangle. Number eight, which number is smaller? Six or twelve, Alana? Six. Number nine just says draw a plus sign. It tells you to add. So all you have to do is draw a plus sign. And number ten says to circle the group that has more. Which of these groups of little mice or hamsters has more? The first group or the second group? Logan? The first group. There's one, two, three, four, five in the first group, and only one, two, three, four in the second group. Okay? All right. Good job. Put that to the side, and then get out your phonics book. And in phonics today, we should have tore out this little book. This book is page 29 and 30. And we're going to just set this to the side, because we're going to read it tomorrow and answer some questions in it. So do, don't take it home or throw it away or anything, just set it to the side. But we are going to look at page 31. Yes, you can put it in your book also. And then open your book to page 31. 31. Ava, 31, please. Form 31, please. Logan, 31, please. On page 31, it just says to add F to each word to make a new word. Then write the new word. So all you had to do was go through and add an S to each of these words at the end. And then trace over the word. So what is this first word that we made when we added an S? Christian? Bats. So then you're going to write the word bats on the line. What is Number two, what is the second word? Caitlin. Digs. Very good. What is number three? Christian. Sit. Good. What is number four? Claire? Good. Pops on the 
Christian, what is number five? Christian. Wags, like the dog wags his tail. We're going to write wags on the line. What is number six? Adam. Wins. Good. Write wins on the line. All right. So that's what you had to do on this page. So make sure you added an S and traced over each word and then wrote that word on the line with an S at the end. Okay. Number seven and number eight at the bottom. It says complete each sentence with the word that you wrote. So you are going to use one of these words that we added an S to at the top to complete the sentence. Number seven, the cat blank on the hat. What goes in that sentence, Mason? Um, I don't know if it's taps. That makes sense, but I think there's another one that makes even more sense. Colin? Sits. The cat sits on the hat. So you're going to make, write the word sits. V. Good, I know. You should, because it's pretty easy. And I explained everything what to do. Number eight says, Dad, blank, a big van. Logan, wins. Dad wins a big van. But has isn't one of our words. It has to be one of these words. Bats, digs, sits, taps, flags, wins. So the only other one that would make sense is dad wins a big van. I guess a surprise. Maybe he was like on a show or something and won. Yeah, that happens. All right, so make sure you get those filled in. Please, Mo. Let's go, friend. All right, so I want you to turn to page 32. Read and write. It says sage picture name. Circle the word for the picture and write it on the line. Number one. What is that a picture of? Jordan. Wig. So you're going to circle W-I-G and write wig on the line. Number two. What is that a picture of? I think they might make some cookies or some cake. Adam. Mix. They're mixing the food together. Mixing the ingredients. Mix. Number three. Clear. Hit. Very good. They hit the ball with the box. Number four is a little bit difficult. We have kit, quit, and quiz. Which of those would it be? Carter? A quiz, yeah. Good. Q-U-I-Z. Number five. What did they do to that paper? Jordan. Rip. Good. R-I-P. And number six. It's pointing to a part on that sharp. Taylor? Ben. Good. All right, so if you have your little book, what I want you to do, if you want to stick it right after page 32, because 33 is where we will start tomorrow, okay, and then that will be all for our morning work, so we can put those books away. Good job.